Hello guys, today I want to talk about resource controllers in Laravel and specifically about scenario where you have not the full crud of all seven methods of index, edit, create and all the others, but just a few methods. So in that case, do you create separate routes, single routes, or do you still use route resource? And this is a typical scenario for front facing page where you have just the list of resources. In my case, it's list of courses and then the show page only two. So there's no admin panel. There's no edit or delete or update or forms. It's just a front facing page. So what do you put in the routes then? I see developers quite often creating separate routes. So route get courses or plural form of the word with index. And then they provide the name of something dot index and also courses show with the name of dot show. But in my opinion, even if you have two methods, it's worth using route resources like this. Route resource in itself controller implements the standard of Laravel of how things should be named. So if you stick to that standard, the naming convention, then you don't need to provide that manually. That resource controller would know or guess that the route for index is pointing to the index method with the name route name of plural form dot index. So you don't need to provide method or route name. Similarly, the second courses slash whatever would automatically point to show method and would automatically be assigned the name route name of courses dot show. And also you have one line instead of two lines in the routes. And also you may optionally, not necessarily, but optionally provide the only method, which has two meanings. First meaning is to provide the information for future developers like your future teammates or maybe yourself in the future that you have only two methods here, but also it would act differently in the case when someone tries to launch that URL in the browser, trying to point to the method that does not exist. For example, if someone puts in the URL courses slash one slash edit, trying to guess the edit form. If you don't provide that only, then that route would succeed because the route exists according to the route controller, resource controller, and it would try to find that method, which would fail because the method does not exist in the controller. So it would throw a controller exception, which from what I remember results in 500 server error to the user. But if you provide the only here, then routes would work only for those methods and edit method wouldn't even count as that rule of route resource. So Laravel will immediately throw 404 not found and wouldn't even go to check the controller. So I do advise to use only or the opposite. For example, if you have four methods, the other way around, you can do except, for example, you have all the methods except delete or except update and delete, for example. So this is the opposite from the only. What do you think about this approach? Do you use separate routes or do you use route resource? And on the topic of route resource, I advise you to watch an old video, evergreen video by Adam Watton, Cruddy by Design. And on Laravel Daily, I have an article summarizing that, rephrasing that with my own thoughts and opinions, with the main point that everything is crud. You just need to think about that as crud. Of course, it's just one opinion. And there are many ways how you can structure things in Laravel, but this is one way to have a standard way how we structure routes and controllers so that other developers would easily understand the structure and the code. I will link both that article and the original video by Adam in the description below. We can also discuss in the comments, do you agree with that cruddy by design philosophy? That's it for this time and see you guys in other videos.